everybody and welcome back to Pokemon White Nuzlocke. Uh, the last episode, I beat the gym without dying, which was very surprising for me. But now we talked to Funnel, she wants us to go to the dream yard. So off screen, I went ahead and taught Alejandro cut, and then I taught Courtney uh, work up, because I think she deserves it at this point for that amazing fight that she did. So this tree looks like it'd be cut down. You know what I realized? Let's not cut this down yet. Hold on. We gotta... Okay, before we cut that down, I just realized there's another tree on Route 1 that we can cut down. <laughs> I completely forgot about it. Excuse me? Okay, it's right over here, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. What's over here? Give me... There we go. It's an item. A super potion. Okay, that's gonna be pretty good for now. Anything over here? Yep. A great ball, okay. Pretty good. Alrighty, now we'll go back to the stream yard and actually cut down that tree. And we can get a new Pokemon over here. Even though that we got, like, the Pan Sage over here and everything, I'm still going to do an encounter. Because I said so. <laughs> Alrighty. There, oh, shit. Okay. Hi, Chris. Are you looking for the mysterious Pokemon, too? Yep, I at least tried to. But you interrupted me. I'm just really, really wondering about how Dream works. I don't know. It's a little Mula cry. Hey, did you hear a sound coming from the other side of that wall? Come on, let's go see. Alrighty. Oh, it's a Muna. Hopefully, we get one in our roll. Moon. Oh, wait. Uh oh. We found you, Muna. Come on, come on. Make some dream mist. Moon. Uh oh. Huh? Who are you? What are you doing? Are you talking about us? We're Team Plasma. We battle day and night to liberate Pokemon from foolish humans. What are we doing? This the Pokemon Muna and Musharna emanate a mysterious vapor called Dream Mist, which shows people's dreams. We're going to use that to make people want to release their Pokemon. We'll show them dreams that manipulate their hearts. Muna. <laughs> Come on, spit out that Dream Mist. You're kicking a Pokemon to make it give off Dream Mist? That's mean. Why, you're, gym you're trainers too, right? That's right. We're Pokemon trainers too, but we're fighting for a different reason. Unlike you two, we're fighting for the freedom of Pokemon. And setting Pokemon free means that we win Pokemon battles and take Pokemon by force. So on that note, we're going to rescue your Pokemon from you! What? Don't hurt Chris! I love the, the, the Team Plasma music, it's so good. Alright, random male grunt with a pat rat. Okay, this should be easy. I'm just going to keep using Ember until it burns and dies. <laughs> Perfect. Went down easy. Pass by. Oh, our beautiful dream. I got four hundred dollars. Are you not taking them seriously because they're kids? Well, whatever. I'm next. Alright. 
Okay, this thing should be easy. Let's just use this. Just keep using Ember like we did last time. hit by sand attack like once we don't know how to aim now okay I'm gonna use tackle and that should kill it what <sighs> damn it stop using sand attack on me I can't hit you <laughs> finally Owen's level 12 now. Plasma, this is a nightmare. $400! I can't believe we lost. But we have to obtain the Dream Mist. Come on, make with the Dream Mist. Knock it off! What are you two doing goofing off? We, Team Plasma, shall separate Pokemon from foolish humans. If you cannot fulfill your duties. This isn't against us when he's gathering followers or against us when he's trying to control people by tricking them with speeches. Yeah, this is against us when a plan has failed and he's about to issue punishment. At this rate, what's hurrying? Say we're sorry so he can forgive us. Oh, Musharna! I love her little sprite in this. What was that just now? The po that person called Gensis appeared all over the place and wasn't real, right? Could that have been a dream? And that Pokemon. Oh! I couldn't wait till I came over. Is that Musharna? Ah, so cute. Did something happen? Oh, Fennel. Well, you see, Muna was here, but Team Plasma and Muna and Musharna came, and it showed us something like a dream. And then Team Plasma. I think I followed that. See, Musharna evolves from Muna, so seeing Muna in trouble, it uses power making dreams into reality to say Muna. Which means... Wait a second. Is this Dream Mist? <laughs> With this, I can complete my research. You two come to my house later, okay? Phew, how random was that? Chris, why don't you go to Fennel's house? Me? Well, I'm going to look around for the Pokemon we saw just now. Oh, me too. Hopefully we'll get it and not a pat rat. I believe there's some items we can get around here. No, we can't access beyond this wall just yet. That's post-game, which we're not doing for a Nuzlocke. We're just going to beat the champion and get the hell out of here, but... There's, I know there's a Pokeball over here. There we go. Alright, Pal, okay. I think there's more up here. We're gonna need every item we can get. Potion. There's probably another potion down there. I'm gonna go grab it and then we'll go roll for our encounter. Hopefully it's not an odd no. Alright. It was a Pokeball, okay. Free catching. Alright, let's see what we get. And it's a pat rat, okay. Oh, it's a girl! Finally, another girl on our team. I'm going to... Hmm. I'm gonna just try to catch it normal without damaging it. I'm trying to think of a good nickname. I think I have one. But maybe reading the description will help as well. 
All right, uh, I'm not, no, no, no. I'm not losing a Pokemon while I'm trying to do this. Oh, Corny has an item. I gotta go see what that is. Maybe she also picked up some Dream Mist, who knows. All right, let's try this again. Should we try to hit it? Oh, no. I'll try to tackle it. Okay. If that crit, I would have cried. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Pokeball. Oh, come on! I was so close! I need to switch Corny out because I feel like she's going to die right here. Well, let's press the run button right there. We would have ran away and we would have failed that encounter. Great ball. We only have one. It was, it was close with the other one, so great ball is like a guarantee, right? All right, we got it. Pat, where was Scott? The data has been transferred. Okay. Extremely cautious, they take shifts to maintain the consistent watch of their nest. They feel in. Insecure without a lookout. Hmm. With the most annoying move set possible, I think I know what to name this thing. Uh, we're naming her Izzy. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, stop hitting random buttons on my on my keyboard. Let's see, it's easy. Why? Perfect. All right, we're gonna go heal, because we desperately need to. Oh yeah, we gotta see what Courtney has in her hand. What does this, what does this girl got? Antidote, okay. And let's look at Izzy's stuff. A hasty nature, which means plus speed minus defense. Prevents other people, other Pokemon from lowering accuracy. Okay, and we have that annoying move bind, so that's gonna be fun to play with. <laughs> All right, let's go over and heal because we desperately need to. <laughs> and then we'll run over to Fennel and do this thing. So we have like little shapes on this little box now. <laughs> now, if you guys don't mind, I will be skipping through that as fast as possible. Because honestly, you, I don't think you can use it in a ROM, let alone now if you have a DS. So these functions do not matter in the slightest. And even if I tell this girl no, that I don't want to hear it, she's still going to be like, Oh, anyway. <laughs> Check save files. Yep. This thing literally has no function anymore. Yeah, yeah, just, just go ahead and turn it on so it looks pretty. Oh yeah, ours are a little hexagons since we're playing as a boy. Uh, no, actually. <sighs> See? Even if we say no, she's gonna be like, yeah, yeah, anyway. Yeah, you can't use any of these functions anymore, so there's literally no point. I don't even think we can use that little, like, the, the pal pad anymore. But it's okay. 
Yeah, yeah, you can register friends. Alright, can we go now? Alright. Alrighty. Now we can head over to Route 3 and beat up some school children. I believe once we get served, we can come back here and get an encounter. But for right now, we cannot. We're going to collaborate our strength and do our best, so watch out! Um, one plus one is two, right? Alrighty. Kumi and Amy. Two Perlin, okay. Oh, my game is slowing down from this double battle. Alright, let's burn one. Should we just. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take care of two at once. Oh. Yeah, Perlin's don't hit hard at all. There we go. Alright, and then we'll just burn the other one. And tackle the other one. And that cat's dead. Pokemon, get up, go! Oh no, our Pokemon burnt out. Well, I think they just got burned. <laughs> Alright. We'll go up there a little, little bit. I just want to get my encounter. I forgot Sharon battles us. I'm not prepared. <laughs> Chris, stop. We both have the trio badge, so let's see which one of us is stronger. <laughs> I don't have time for this, Sharon. <laughs> I forgot that he battles you. <laughs> I can't have a moment of peace in this game. And I have Owen now in the front. That's not good. Maybe I can switch and put DJ out. I could probably do that. Water gun shouldn't be that much. Yep, okay, it's fine. Um, alright, fine with it. I wouldn't call that a good move, it's just me trying my best over here. <laughs> Oh yeah, this thing's got a damn orange berry. Water sport. Fire powers weakened. There's no fire out on the floor right now. Alright, this thing needs to die. Alright, the Oshawott's dead. <laughs> DJ better get a level from this. He did not. Yeah, just keep, just keep him out. Um, let's try Leer. We're gonna stare this cat down. house. Um, should I paralyze? No, nah, I'll just keep using Vine Whip. Okay, 
you lower my attack again. That's great. Oh wait, that's the fence. I'm going to switch out. <laughs> These ain't doing too good. Um, yeah, let's put Alejandra out. Why not? Yeah, I didn't realize how close Alejandro was to leveling up. Um, can you- can you not? Wh All right, Alejandro's going away again. Um, let's put out Courtney. Alright, um, Taco should kill it. If it doesn't use sand attack. Hooray, we're not dead. 63. is now 11. And DJ's now level 12. Our babies are getting, uh, are growing up. Why do you keep beating me? We have the same number of gym badges. We should be equals in strength. Well, you have two Pokemon and I have five. Maybe that's the problem that we're having. I see. So that's how you battle. Out of the way! What was that about? Bianca, why are you running? Hey, where are those two people head? That way, but... Why are you running now? Oh, seriously, they ran so fast. Miss... Oh, my Pokemon. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. It'll cry. Bianca, really, why were you running? <laughs> you have to hear this. Those people stole this girl's Pokemon. You should have spoken up sooner. We're gonna get that Pokemon back. Yanka, stay here by that girl's side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. <laughs> I was at the front. Okay. So we have a chance of getting a Blitzel or a Padove on this route. And we got a Padove. I guess that's okay. <laughs> Um, I don't think I can hit this thing without killing it, so we're just gonna... I only have three Pokeballs, so hopefully that does not kill it. Oh, didn't even... Do I have any Pokemon that can hit this thing without one-shotting it? Izzy? Izzy's our lowest right now. And it's Tackle. Alright. Izzy's really fine against this thing since it keeps using Gust. Okay. Uh, just Tackle it once. Do not critical hit it. Oh, it was a critical hit, but it didn't kill it. Alright, um, I have two Pokeballs left, so hopefully we can catch it so we won't have a failed encounter on this route. And then I need to go back and get more Pokeballs for the, the cave. And that's another encounter. One, two, three... Fuck yeah, we got a Pidove. Alright, let's see. It's a girl. Well, let's see what she says. These Pokemon live in cities. They're accumulate accustomed to people. Blocks often gather in parks and plazas. I think it says somewhere in like in the in Pokemon Black where it's like always confused and doesn't know what's going on. Oh, I don't know what to name it. Yes. Hmm. 
Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> A confused bird. Oh, I got it. We're naming it Zoe. Perfect. I need to go back in. Alright, I was scared that Bianca would be like, where are you going? <laughs> I need to heal, and I need to buy some Pokeballs. I'll probably be up some school children that will probably end it. Alright. Yes, I would like to heal my Pokemon. Please, 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 and thank you. Why is it being so slow? Sometimes this game runs incredibly well, and other times it's like slow. <laughs> Alright, and let's do like 10, so we'll get a Premier Ball. Yes. Hooray. Alright, so we'll head to the daycare and start leveling up some of our, our people. Should I have Izzy out in the front for some of this since she's the... Well, actually, I guess Zoe's the lowest now, but... I don't know how we're gonna level her up safely, you know? And we got a full team of early people. I was really hoping for a Blitzel, but we didn't get one. I wonder if we get a Blitzel later on. I don't think so. I feel invincible when I'm around the smiles of children and Pokemon. I think we have time for two battles, and then we'll probably end it. A little pup. Little doggy. And I think. Yep, yeah, Izzy. I just put her on the front. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. You know what? Izzy's done enough training today. <laughs> we'll level her up safely off screen. Um. Owen doesn't seem like a bad fit here. I believe our new level cap is 20 for the, the, the next gym, so we should be fine to level up to everyone at least 14, you know? Alright. Alright. No one should be level 13 now. Good job. Defense curl? No, you don't know those kinds of moves. And a Muna. Alejandro doesn't have any dark moves, but at least he can't get hit by any psychic type moves, so. Can't wait for the same to learn, like, bite at some point. Use assist and see what we get. As, as, long, as long as it's not bind, we should be fine. Okay. Oh, it's using defense curl. That's not good. Alright, we'll move it this time. Yawn! I don't think this had to have yawn. Alright, we're just gonna switch to Courtney. At least Courtney has a dark type move.
I know I said I had time for another battle, but I think I'm just gonna end it here. And then we'll be able to school children in the next one. Cause I can already tell this moon is gonna be annoying. Alright, one more should do it. Hooray! Wow, great, great, you're very strong. Four hundred dollars? I didn't ask you to give you a raise around here. I think we have time for another one. Should we- I'm gonna just put Zoe in the front and then... And then as soon as they see the opponent, I'm gonna switch to Courtney. Oops. Hey, trainer, have a battle with me. All right. I don't remember which monkey these kids had. I know it's one of each monkey. Dolly? Who the fuck names their kid Dolly? All right. This one has Pan Poor. Actually, I probably should switch to DJ since it's a grass. Yeah, let's do that. You know what? <laughs> so we got her three seconds of screen time, both being caught and out in this battle. Water gun. We'll probably just spam Vine Whip until this thing goes down. Oh, it- Oh, I critical hit it! I was like, oh, there's no way that DJ is that powerful. Oh, it's always level 9. That's good. I just realized now that since we got, um, an encounter in this route, we can start farming for Adenos. So that's gonna be good for me later. Eh, just do another one. Why not? Trainer, I wanna play with you! I forget these kids only have like one Pokemon, so might as well just finish this area and then we'll end it. Fancier. We don't have a water boy yet, but we do have a Courtney. Alright. So the Courtney will go out. I hate battling like this. Instead of giving, like, Zoe an XP share, because we don't have one yet. Which- I mean, we won't get one in Castilia City, I just- We just don't have it yet. So we're just gonna farm the old-fashioned way. Which is having it look at the Pokémon, and then having another Pokémon kill it. <laughs> Alright, Courtney's level 14 now. Trainer, you're too strong. 40 bucks? Yeah, tell your mom to give you more lunch money. Alright. Take this! Hyper Beam! Alright, what's your name? Tolly? Man, your, your parents must have really hated you. <laughs> Alright, so we can put Owen out in front of this thing. This is a grass type. I can't trust Zoe to do this. There's no way she can. Okay, yeah, Owen should be fine. It's a fucking monkey. So grass shouldn't do that much to it. Okay, that did like nothing. Alright, we're fine. Just one more, and that should do it for this area. Alright! And Zoe is now level 10. Good job, Zoe, for just standing there. Whoops. <laughs> just robbed a bunch of kids for their lunch money. Alright, this should be fine. 
Alrighty. I'm gonna go back to where we started. Alright. Alrighty. So, we did the dream yard stuff. We got an encounter in the dream yard, and then we came to Route 3, kicked Charon's ass, and then we caught up a dove. So, off screen, let me view my party real quick. So off screen, I'm gonna probably get everyone up to level 15 and everything. And oh yeah, we didn't look at Zoe's thing at all. I just realized that impish nature plus defense minus special attack. That's probably pretty good. Protects the Pokemon from defense lowering attacks. Okay, that's gonna be good. All right, so off screen. I'm going to get all, all these Pokemon up to level 15 to just farming through autos on this route. And then I'll, in the next episode, if anything spectacular happens, like new moves and everything, I'll just go through and show you guys one up. I'm just going to put Courtney in for it in front since she's like one level away. But anyway, um... Next episode, we'll head over to Wellspring Cave, do our encounter there, and deal with Team Plasma, and make our way to Nacarine City. So, thank you for joining me on this Nuzlocke. I'll be back soon. Bye!